I officially welcome all to the 54th annual Monticello Independence Day celebration, the longest running naturalization ceremony outside of a courtroom. And are there any of you who find their backsides just a little wet who would like for me to get this thing moving along? <laughs> Raise your hands. Huh? Yeah, yeah, you're out there too. Well, all of you are going to have your wishes granted. They're all here, you know. All the symbols and colliding histories and identities of America, right here, in the rain, shrouded in the mist. Jefferson's home, his Cathedral of Liberty, but it was also a plantation that kept slaves. Immigrants being sworn in at a moment in history when America cannot find a way to clearly articulate to tell immigrants, welcome or to stay away. We hold these truths to be self-evident, that all men are created equal, that they are endowed by their creator with certain unalienable rights, that among these are life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. We are nearly all descended from immigrants, just like you. I'm overwhelmed. I am grateful to stand before you. Thank you very much for giving me this opportunity to stand here and um, enjoy this moment with everybody else. I am now just American woman, not Russian, not Iraqi, not Muslim, not Christian. I'm just Nawal, a Shamad American woman. Today I just feel a sense of responsibility. Um, making my daughter see that democracy works and that she has a voice. As the land of opportunity for the gifted. So help me God. Congratulations, you are American citizens. <laughs>